During road construction, as well as in places where traffic is heavy or unmanageable, a new solution has been developed to help safely reroute traffic lanes. Meet the Road Zipper Machine, a heavy-duty concrete barrier mover. Crews place one-meter sections of highly reinforced concrete barriers in a straight line in the road, pinning them together to form a continuous barrier wall. Each barrier has a T-top, which the road zipper uses to lift the section and pass it through a conveyor system within the machine. Once passed through, the machine gently sets each section back onto the road with no damage to the surface. Patented variable length barriers and expansion joints allow for the wall to be curved as the road zipper makes subtle changes in direction. Moving at speeds of up to 10 miles per hour, an entire lane section can be relocated up to 24 feet. By quickly creating new or existing lanes of safer, free-flowing traffic, this incredible machine may have already helped save precious lives. If you've ever dreamed of having your own personal flying machine, that day may soon be here. This is the Martin Jetpack, a personal flying craft straight out of the pages of science fiction. Though previously featured on Freeze HD as the new way for Bubba Watson to navigate the links, this spectacular machine is ready for all who dare to take to the air. With a flight time of at least 30 minutes, a range of 30 to 50 kilometers, and a top speed of 74 kilometers per hour, first responders could quickly reach victims in areas unreachable by ground vehicles. Able to fly from just above ground level to its flight ceiling of approximately 3,000 feet, search and rescue teams would have a much better view of the terrain. This beast can be flown both manually and remotely, with technological advances nearly complete that will allow for groups of jetpacks to fly coordinated missions. Perhaps one day soon, machines like the Martin Jetpack could be accepted for use as a viable means of transportation for us common folk. Bring it on! When NATO forces need to cross a river where no bridge exists, no problem. They bring their own bridge. This is the M3 Amphibious Bridge Rig from General Dynamics European Land Systems. Used for the projection of military vehicles across water obstacles, two large aluminum pontoons are carried by a powerful 4x4 amphibious vehicle. With a maximum road speed of 80 km per hour, the M3 can be delivered fast wherever it's needed. Once in the water, the amphibious M3 vehicle can move at 14 km per hour. Eight M3s are used to bridge each 100 meters of water. In this footage taken at the Vistula River in Poland, British and German forces are combining 34 M3 rigs to construct what was believed to be the longest amphibious bridge then in existence. Once constructed, this bridge is sturdy enough to be crossed by 60-ton battle tanks. With equipment like the M3, even a river can't stop a determined force. If you're a fan of 1990s-era Grand Prix race cars and also happen to love coffee, have we got the perfect coffee maker for you. Yes, these beautiful engines aren't engines at all. They're actually espresso machines. South African manufacturer Super Veloce crafts these jaw-dropping machines out of such exotic alloys as magnesium, titanium, and aluminum. Half the size of the original high-octane power plants, each model is offered in V8, V10, and V12 configurations. Each of these beautiful creations is exquisitely detailed and polished to a gorgeous shine. Once your coffee is made, your highly concentrated daily dose of caffeine is held in a reservoir that's located where the engine's oil pan would be. Models include the Nero Carbonio, the Series Titanium, and the Aurum 18 CT. If you prefer jets to cars, the Aviator Fast may be more suited to your tastes. With very limited production, pricing for these high-end machines is only available by request. Try not to get all revved up when you get the answer. Have no fear, this is not a mechanized alien invader from the planet Mars. It's the walking harvester prototype from John Deere subsidiary Timberjack. Designed in the 1990s for forest workers in rough mountain areas in snow and mud, the walking harvester moved on six articulated legs. An onboard computer system and advanced sensors embedded in the legs adjusted each step to match the ground's texture and slope. Evenly distributing the vehicle's weight on uneven surfaces, the harvester can move in any direction with minimum impact on the terrain. 
Because the machine operator could adjust the ground clearance, this insane machine could easily step over most obstacles. Of the two prototypes that were built, one was fitted with a front harvester head that could pick up and strip a felled tree in seconds. Though these incredible machines were too far ahead of their time for mass production, the walking harvester totally redefined the famous saying, walk softly and carry a big stick. So which of these mind-blowing machines did you think were the most insane? Let us know in the comments section below, and do us a favor by clicking that like button. For even more outrageous videos, be sure to subscribe. See you soon.